The purpose of this BMS is to cut off the battery from the load if it reaches 10 volts to avoid the battery from being destroyed if it depletes to 0 volts. This red wire connects the positive of the charger and the load to the positive of the battery. While I use the green wire here to connect the BMS to the negative sides of the solar charge controller, the load, and the battery. So let's see what happens when the battery reaches 10 volts. So lighting a bulb, the battery started to drain until the BMS cuts it off at 10 volts. This balancer slide turns off also. To recharge the battery, I have to connect it to the solar charge controller. Here I connected the plug and let's see if the solar charge controller will charge. The solar charge controller did not turn on or did not charge. This means the BMS is asleep or inactive. Here's the solution. Disconnect the BMS black wire as well as this blue wire. Then connect instead the green negative wires together by passing the BMS. So here is the BMS disconnected. I'll connect the negative wires. They are connected to the negative of the battery and negative of the plug. The battery is now plugged and let's see if it will charge. Yes, the solar charge controller is charging. At 9.9 .9 volts, the BMS cannot turn on the solar charge controller. The battery is now 10 volts. I will reconnect the BMS once the battery becomes 12 volts. BMS can turn on the solar charge controller at 12 volts or maybe at 10 volts. So that's the issue with my BMS and the fix. Thank you. Please like and subscribe.